I'm here to help elevate the experience and do kind of what we talk about where you can come in and just unclench your fist and be like, oh, they did this at a church? Um, I started in college when a friend, was, I was changing majors and she's like, come try out theater. I was like, I don't want to act. And she's like, technical. So I started stage combat, stage lighting and stage design. And I really loved the lighting part and just being a part of the storytelling just in a little way with lighting. So I got more into it and then I was just like, okay, God, how do you want to use this? And it's just been a journey. Yeah, programming is where you're like, you're going through the song, you're telling the lights what to do, when to do them, timing, all that, time code, if you need to program things to hit on a certain beat. And then Sunday running it is just, it's all programmed, it's ready to go. You're just hitting the buttons to make it all happen. It's all about following what the band is doing. They have a point where they're trying to like, reach this like what they call the peak of worship. And I feel like it's my job to help build up to that without going beyond the energy of the band. You don't want the lights going crazy, but the band's not there energy wise. And I like doing stuff out in the crowd a little more and make people feel like they're a part of, because they're part of the worship too. It's not just the people on stage. <laughs> There was a season in my life where I got away from it because I kind of got squished passion-wise at another church. And then slowly God just kept bringing me back. And I just started by volunteering. Wasn't trying to earn money or anything. And just slowly spilled until now I'm on staff. And I'm like, looking back, I'm like, oh, how did that happen? But I just, I just wanted to use whatever little talents I had. This is the first place where it's like, I really am the only one and it's weird being the only girl. <laughs> but I have four women volunteers, so hopefully this allowed them to feel like they could be a part of this more. And we have camera operators that are females too. So it's just like on the weekend, I don't feel alone because there's so many of us helping out. But it, there's a pride that hopefully other women can see it and be like, oh, I could do that too. I'm Christy and I program the lights here at Flatirons.